Hey Fire Signs, Aries Sag Leo, thanks for tuning in. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be a special tarot reading about your crush, where they're at, what they're going to do and how you'll respond. So we'll suss out the situation and see what's going on with your romantic interest. So it can be for Aries Sag or Leo, or if you're dealing with an Aries Sag Leo, this reading can certainly be applicable for you. Um, if you're after a private reading, please feel free to reach out. Otherwise, don't forget to like, share and subscribe subscribe to the channel um, and join the YouTube fam. I want to jump straight into this reading and see what's going on with your romantic interest. First of all, let's try to channel their current energy for fire signs. Okay, fire signs, what's going on here? So straight away, two sixes. It makes me feel like six is a number of um, our intuition and our sixth sense. So first of all, I'm getting an energy where your crush is starting to feel like you're not into them. Okay, they're picking up subconscious energy, intuitive energy. Okay, they're very intuitive right now. Um, and they're picking up some sort of energy that there's been some distance between the both of you. Or they feel like you've grown distant towards them. I get a lot of sense that things are one-sided with the Six of Pentacles here. Um, so right now your crush is feeling like probably they're doing, you know, they're putting in a lot more attention or you are putting in a lot more attention. I want to say with the Six of Swords, I feel like they're backing away. And I feel like they're backing away because they've put in a lot more energy than maybe you have. So they're feeling like they're probably the only one still invested. There's an energy where they're like, okay, well, I keep showing you i keep showing this fire sign attention and i'm you know i'm trying to get their attention i'm trying to do this for them i'm trying to do that for them and suddenly they feel like they want to back away because of that so if you have noticed this person has distanced themselves fire signs chances are it's because they're you're not giving them back what they're putting in um so i feel like there's a distancing here with the six of swords i get a sense that they're trying to move on or trying the boat is protection, so I'm getting a sense that they're trying to protect themselves and they feel like there's no longer something that they can pursue with you. So something has put them off. I mean, I feel like they're in a desperate sort of situation here or they're being overly desperate, okay? Um, maybe they've recently done something where they feel like a fool. Okay, we've got that those desperate figures and they probably feel like maybe they embarrass themselves by doing something showing you too much attention or doing something and you didn't really reciprocate fire signs so this person has noticed it and gone uh-oh like what have i done oh my god i'm embarrassed they've seen this they feel like i'm desperate you know they, they might have begged or pleaded for your attention or done something you know like there's a feeling of feeling um pathetic so i get a sense that they're feeling pathetic about themselves or unhappy with the way they did something because they came across super super desperate um and I think what the, that is telling me is that that's why they're distancing themselves with the Six of Swords. They're trying to move away from the situation and trying to be more level-headed. The scales are coming in, so they're probably thinking more level-headed than they recently have. And now they're thinking, okay, well, I made a fool of myself. The fire sign wasn't interested. I'm going to go. Let's see, though. What will their next move be? What do they intend to do or say? Okay, they're leveling up, I feel, with the Empress. Um, I feel like they want to show something off. They're going to level up. They're going to try to come back bigger, better, stronger. They probably want to try to intimidate you here. Um, you know, with the Empress, she's very attractive. So I feel like this person's going to get a new haircut, lose a bit of weight, um, get a whole new wardrobe. Definitely to try to impress. Okay, they definitely want you to notice them. So I feel like they'll do something extravagant. I don't think it's minor. I think it's pretty big. Um, they're going to do something quite extravagant to sort of show you what you're missing. Um, so it's like I get a sense that this person wants to, um, they want to show you what you're missing out on fire signs. Um, and I feel like the motivation underneath it all is because they feel emotionally lost. Okay. Seven of Cups, they're a bit of all over the place, so I'm predicting some mixed messages that you're about to get from this person. 
they'll act really interested, they'll do those things just to show off to you and then they'll sort of back away at the same time. So be prepared for a lot of this mixed messages, um, a lot of eye contact, a lot of forwardness, you know, a lot of chatter, um, this person chasing you and then they back off completely. So you can sort of expect that. Why? Because they're lost, but they obviously still want to impress you. So there's still residual feelings that exist within this person towards you. Um, but I feel like the Empress, it can be like a date. I do feel like for some of you, this person is going to do something quite lavish to either themselves or to you. Like they'll leave flowers on your desk. They'll invite you to a date. They'll organize a picnic. They'll get work lunch for you. Like there's something quite meaningful, you know, buy you a bottle of wine, get you an early Christmas present or something, um, get you a birthday gift, a gift of any kind. And, um, and I feel like it's, probably coming up because it's their way of showing you those feelings um it's their way of yeah it's their way of doing that i feel um i feel like the seven of cups is telling me it's their subconscious that's driving them to do this um I also feel like as they sort of level up in whatever way, they're going to attract other crushes as well. Okay, so that's when they're going to start to feel a little bit lost and you might notice the all the attention and the energy might not be on you so much fire signs, but you know what's going to happen. They're going to start being interested in someone else and then you're going to want them more than ever because their attention is not yours. Um, I get like the biggest way to get someone's interest is to remove yours and I feel like this applies here you're going to see the attention shy away from you um, and then it's going to be on someone else and you're going to want them more than ever fire signs isn't that always the way let's have a look though how will your response be to this Okay, I feel like you're responding with the Queen of Pentacles, so I feel like your energy is going to shift and you're going to be more interested. Um, I feel like you're going to show them more attention, you're going to start to show them more attention because you'll see them level up. So you'll be like, wow, I want this person now. They, they're looking great. They're exuding a lot of confidence. I have to make them mine. I want them to chase me again. So I feel like you're going to respond in that some way. But I also feel like there's reciprocity here. So if they're going to give you something, I feel like you're going to give it back to them. Um, so whatever they're giving you, I feel like uh, you're going to give, yeah, you're going to give it back to them. So there's like giving back, I get, or like an even exchange. And um, the two of pentacles is also here. So I feel like you're going to start to give them mixed messages here as well, especially if for a long time, you've sort of like kept them on the back burner. You haven't been that interested. Two of pentacles is telling me you're going to be more forward, more back, more forward, step back, more forward, step back. So I feel like there's a bit of cat and mouse that's going to happen here from your side um, with the two of pentacles. I also feel like you might be, you, you'll you start to compare your crush to someone else that's significant in your life. Okay, I see you weighing up, especially those that have multiple crushes, multiple admirers and people trying to hook up with you. I actually see you comparing the two, like putting attention on one crush, putting attention on the other crush. And you know, that's great that you have so many fire signs. Can't say I'm surprised, um, but I feel like, yeah, you're going to be weighing those up. You're going to be weighing up that energy going, which one's better? Which one do I want more attention from? I also feel like you might be doing that distancing as well. So I'm saying you're going to be throwing mixed messages. You're interested, but at the same time, you want to step back. And there's other people on the horizon here that are going to have your attention as well. Um, Yeah, that's what I'm picking up. Um, I will leave it at that fire signs though. So thank you so much for tuning in. It really does mean a lot. Uh, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel. And if you are after a private reading, please feel free to reach out to me and we can go ahead uh, and try to arrange that for you. Um, otherwise, thank you so, so much for being here with me. I really do appreciate it. All the best and until next time. Bye for now.